We should all agree the answer is not to defund the police. It's to fund the police. Fund them. Fund them. Fund them with resources and training. Resources and training they need to protect our communities. I ask Democrats and Republicans alike to pass my budget and keep our neighborhoods safe. Now, I wish that's not the bite that I would have said he hit his marks on, because to me, that was um, false. That was false. Fund the police, mm -hmm. fund the police. That was okay. false. Is from where I sit as a black person, that's not about training, because as you and I talk about often on this show, respecting people and not being, um, not stereotyping people and being racist, whether it's, you know, an inherent thing, whether you're conscious of it or it's unconscious bias, it's all the same. It results in dead black bodies. I don't believe that it's about training. I think it's about a larger societal issue. And I think police have plenty of resources. I think they have plenty of resources. I think if you would get rid of the tanks and some of these other measures that are terrorizing certain neighborhoods, maybe you have money for some other things. Maybe I'm just speaking out of school. But that particular clip that, you know, the two ladies behind him <clears throat> either felt that way organically or had to stand up and pretend they did, I didn't I didn't care for that clip. Mm -hmm. But that's just me. Yeah, I mean, that, that one's going to uh, resonate throughout the black community for all the reasons you just talked about and everything that we've had to go through, not just over the last couple of years, because obviously, let's, let's admit, look, the issues that black Americans have had with the police force didn't start with George Floyd, nor will it end with George Floyd. It's been going on for many years. It's just not being recorded. The revolution, when it comes to that, is being recorded because everybody has a camera phone, everybody has social media. Um, when it comes to the fund, the police, there's so many different variations and so many different definitions of what it actually means. And I don't know if a lot of people know exactly what it means. It doesn't mean get rid of the police force. It just means, uh, in my opinion, I think allocating some of those, uh, some of that money into other areas. Now, if he is saying give more funds to the police, meaning get rid of some of the terrible police officers who shouldn't be police officers in the first place, training the ones that want to be police officers and a good police officers, and then allocating more of those funds towards mental health issues and mental health professionals and people like that and putting it back in the community and community policing, I can get down with that. So things like that, when it comes to yeah, saying the that. word or the phrase defund the police, it needs to be a little bit more spelled out than just saying, hey, give more money to people uh, that are out there that, that mean no harm, that want to break our necks instead of protect our necks when it comes to uh, policing in our communities. That needs to be uh, a little bit more spelled, uh, a little mm -hmm. bit more clearly.